Guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Guys, I haven't been here for about, I think since February. February, March, April. Yeah, it's going to three months. February, around April, around there. Anyway, I mean, February, March, around there. Anyway, I'm going to be showing you my room tour. I wanted to come back. If you guys know the reason why I wasn't on YouTube, it's because I had an accident. So I had to take like time off or whatever, but it's not a big deal anymore. Thank God I'm better. My burns, this one, they're actually getting better. Here's another one. Stuff I will go into detail in another video, but not right now. But anyways, I'm finally gonna be doing my room tour. So yeah, without further ado, let's get started. So first, I'm going to be starting off with this section of my room. So this table, actually, I was going to buy um, a dresser, but I couldn't find one. So I just decided to tell my step-grandpa to build me this table. So shout out to him. So here we go. So the first thing on this wall here, hey peeps, it's my um, deer horn head. Obviously, you guys know I love deer horns. I have this banner that I bought at Target. It was like $3 or whatever. Um, here, I have this little vase thing. I like it because it's like rustic and stuff and i like it because of the dream catcher here's a drawing i did like three years ago here's another deer horn oh my god my little thing fell <laughs> here's my little buddha my little buddha whatever here is a little table i mean a little plate it says can't touch this and it has an elephant and two pair of my favorite earrings and then this is like a scent like the little sticks that you um light up or whatever but i didn't want to light them up because they have strong smells and my room smells good right now so it really doesn't matter um here's this mirror ignore the shirt because the paint doesn't go away but here's a mirror that i had on my vanity here is this little this guy interesting fact this i made this these were little um thumbtacks or whatever you want to call it and this was part of like the a wood that he that my step grandpa was cutting so this was in the floor and i just picked it up and i was like let's see what i could do about it so then i decided to that i was going to hold my jewelry here so these are my earrings these are this is a choker this is my moon and i think it's a star name yeah my moon and star necklace these are um my choker like kind of chokers and stuff this is a little stone and this is another choker here I have another deer horn and it has my rings on it like some of the rings I don't even use but I just want to put it because of the aesthetic and in here that charger does not belong here and in here I have um, my picture of me and Joel and you can see my baby back there <laughs> dead this is um this is a necklace I'm going to give to Joel I just um, blessed it and this is a little, I don't know, it's like for a bath, but I just want to put it there because it looks cute. So at the bottom, we have a picture here, and it says, I really tried not to. I have my boots there. I have this little crate that I bought um, at Target. Uh, the little cactus frame thingy, I bought it at Marshalls. Those are my best friends right there. And then I have all my glasses, and I decided to put my diary, the one that I like, holds my deep secrets and the cnco disc because it was just like it like it goes with the aesthetic and here i have this little crate thingy i want to call it i don't know and i just put like all my palettes in there and stuff so yeah this is part one of my room so on this part of my room i have my mirror if the color changes guy it's because of the light i have my mirror here and let me turn this way I bought this mirror at Marshalls, I mean at TJ Maxx, and then here's a rug. This rug, my grandma actually gave it to me. She told me she bought it um, in Five and Below. Guys, my nails. Look at my nails. Oh my god. But yeah, guys, this is the other side of my room with the mirror. I'm gonna go to this side of the room. So when you open the door, obviously if you close it, you're not. If you open it, you're not gonna see this. But if you cl if you close it, you're gonna see this. It's a little frame. The frame that I had is rise and shine. And then on my door, I hear, ignore that. That's my brother. Oh my god. And then here I have on um, my mom's closet because this is like my mom's closet, and then that's my closet. So here I have um, CNCO's poster from their world tour, United States, Houston, Texas. Ah. January 25th. Oh my god. 
can you see their faces guys like wow like wow wow oh yes oh yeah oh yeah like that is like ugh. okay anyways it's too much okay so here is my vanity so let me tell you i didn't want to keep this i was gonna sell it but then i was like no you know what i'm gonna just keep it or whatever so i'm just going to explain fast what i have in here because i want to do like a makeup um vanity slash makeup um tour or whatever so here i have all my brushes I just put a little picture of myself. Um, I have the mirror, the circle mirror that I want, that I like, I mean. And here are all my beauty blenders. And then on this little thing, I wanted to put a plant, but then I was like, where am I gonna have my skincare? So here is like a little bit of my skincare, my little deodorant, and then um, my Clinique. I think it's a moisturizer, I'm pretty sure. My Vaseline and two of the lippies and stuff. So I just keep these in here for like, this other guy I guess I don't know and then the chair obviously my two little fluffy animals but yeah this is this side and if you go to this side over here um I have another frame and it says he taught me how to handle a bike and then I have this purse guys can we just talk about this purse it has the Mexico um calendar I want to yeah this is the calendar the Mexico calendar if I'm mistaken it's not the, okay you know what just if I'm wrong tell me at the bottom but I'm pretty sure it's the Mexican calendar and it's from Mexico I don't know this purse looks freaking crooked now that I'm like maybe it's because of the way it's hanging but anyways this is a purse guys the freaking it cost only 24 bucks at the thrift store guys i was like fuck yeah i have to get it like i'm mexican obviously but this shit right here is bomb as fuck <laughs> and then over here is just the restroom you know i have the deer thing the pictures and then me over here so on this other side of the wall i have a dream catcher and i really didn't want to put i really didn't want to put a lot of things in there because I was like, mm, I don't know. Like, I, at first I had like Polaroids over here, and I was just like, I don't know if I should put Polaroids. So, yeah, but we just have that. Now, this over here is my bed, guys. And let me tell you something. It took me about a month or so to build this wall. This wall is like, it's like a brick wall that I built. You can, you can see like the freaking line of the um, styrofoam. But basically what I did, before I get into detail of my bed and stuff, basically what I did was I grabbed styrofoam. I bought three packs of styrofoam. You could buy like the bigger pack, but basically if you buy the bigger, like the bigger sheets, it's going to be harder. But I bought these and what I did was I made the shape of it first. I got like a brick, um, I got a wood, I got wood and I just like did the line. I did the pattern basically, you know. I'm gonna link down the video where I got the idea from. These are like experts or whatever. I just like did a knockoff or whatever if you wanna call it. So here, if you can see here, um, I melted down with um, a little machine called a plastic welder. Yeah, a plastic welder. So I melt down the things, like the shape or whatever, and then I painted it white. And then the thing is, where I fucked up, is that here, this is um, coking. This is coking right here. So, but basically, I put coking on all over here. If you see here, guys, I had to, like, rip the hole or whatever. But, you know, if you don't, if you really, like, you can see here that you still, like, it still need a little bit. But I didn't want to put a lot because, first of all, it was too much fucking coking. But if you see here, like, if you just see it from a distance, you can't really tell. It's, like, all my family says, oh, my God, I really thought it was a brick wall, but it's not a brick wall. And you can see the highly line of the shape, but the end, I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I like it like that. That's how I'm going to keep it. So, yeah, it's just a little DIY that I did for my room. Now, let's start off with this piece in my bed. Um, I have a picture from here of me and my best friend. This is Brisa Zuli, and then that's me. That was the day of the CNCO concert. I have my Buddha um, head. I have a little candle that I haven't lighted now, but these candles, guys, I recommend you to buy these type of candles in Marshalls. These holes last better than... This shit is broken, guys. Oh, it's not. I recommend you this This candle lasts is better than those Yankee candles. And then I just paired it um, on top. I just put it on top of these books. Um, they're poetry books, and I like poetry books. And these are my little glasses. I don't know where they are. And then this is um, a little... I bought this in OfferUp, the app OfferUp. This is a little... I think it was in Ikea or whatever. And yeah, I have my intimidations in there in here i have like the makeup that i still don't use or like makeup i just can't get over and then here is my recording stuff i bought that 
um, light. I haven't even used it. That's my camera. Here is all my Polaroids. And then here are all my journals. This is the bed, guys. So the bed, I also bought it in offer up. It's an Ikea bed also. And here, I just paired it. I just put, um, I bought this. Okay, guys, you're going to be like, okay, that's too small, Maria. I didn't want to get the long one because I wanted white, the white one to see. So I bought this at uh, Target. I bought this at Target. I think it was like 20 bucks. It was on sale. The pillow, I bought it at Target. That pillow right there, I bought it at a thrift store in Austin. Okay, those pillows, I bought the, I don't know, I'm not sure what my mom, oh, my grandma. My grandma bought these for me. Um, this one, I bought it at Marshall's. These comforters, I mean, these <laughs> these sheets i bought the pillow sheets i bought them on marshall's and these two and then on the side of my bed i just have this little dream catcher over here in the wall i have the lights guys let me tell you i was having such a hard time because i was like where am i gonna put these damn lights i don't know where i'm gonna put these lights and i'm just you know what i'm gonna just put them on top of my bed with this um fuck i forgot what it's called oh my god but anyways you get the point right so I put that in the wall because at first that was right here, but then I was like, oh, I don't really like it there. And I just put the lights over it. And then over here, over here, I have a mess. Well, my bracelets. But over here, I have another picture. Um, just it doesn't even say anything. But I have a little turtle that my aunt brought me from Cancun. I have. Um, a book like a thousand uh, a thousand and one spells a little plant and then a picture of me and um christopher i have that little drum thingy um that i bought at the thrift store in austin and then that's a crate and then over here in this wall i just have um this little thing that says love and then i have my moon stuff but i wanted to put like pictures here i still haven't um decided what i'm gonna do to this wall yet yet because if you see from a far distance it's very like lonely or whatever but then again i was like you know what i really don't want a lot and stuff but i don't know i'll probably put like some pictures of polaroids there or whatever but yeah guys this is my room i hope you guys like it it really took me forever because i was trying to look for that i was trying to see where those lights go i was trying to see where that wall was gonna be and then my bed i didn't know if i wanted this way i didn't want it that way so you know but yeah guys that is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it um if you did give it a thumbs up if you didn't bye i don't care um yeah guys and if you guys are almost at 300k i think i need like four or five subscribers more but 300k what the fuck i wish dude no, we're almost at 300 subscribers, so if you want to subscribe to my channel, please do. You'll help me out a lot, and I love you guys, and I can't wait to start this video. Guys, okay, I have, hold on. I have, I have ideas coming up. So I have one blog. I have two vlogs, actually. One is going to be um, a day in my life. I'm going to have this photo shoot, and you're going to see my best friends, and we're, it's going to be like a day in my life slash a girl's day, you know, or hanging out with my BFFs kind of day. I still don't know the title. But that's going to be up like around um, after May 11th. I'm also going to Mexico. Expect a video on that, guys. I'm going to Mexico. But the thing, here's the thing. They haven't told me the days. So, you know, I don't, I'm really not sure. But even if I don't go, because I'm supposed to go with my, my mom's side of the family. But even if I don't go um, to Mexico, because they're going to Mexico City. Even if I don't go, I'm going to go with my dad's side of the family. And they're going to go to San Luis Potosí. Both of my families are from San Luis Potosí, but um, I don't know. We're gonna go to Mexico City to visit La Virgencita. So yeah, but anyways guys, I have that vlog coming up too. So those are two vlogs. And then I I'm going to Jambalaya, guys. I'm going to Jambalaya. I wanted to go see Travis Scott. When he came to Houston, I couldn't see him because I was in the accident. Um, because of my accident and stuff, I was still um, getting better and stuff. I was still recuperandome or whatever you wanna call it. And yeah, that's why I didn't go. And I was like, you know what, let's go. I just wanna see him, I wanna see Bad Baby because I love that bitch. Like, I don't give a fuck if she's childish or whatever. She's grown as fuck, like, I love that bitch. Anyways, guys, yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next video, bye.